She's right on the pivot point. A big heavy log. Well, there we go. Backed right in there. I dropped it and it said SOS on the screen. Yeah, she dug in, so if I can just get that front end up a bit, maybe I can put the log now right there. We'll see. We'll try something here. Oh, it hit this root. That's what happened. She hit that root. If I can just get it over the top of that, we should be good. Okay. Well, look at this, folks. I'm moving that with one hand. She's right on the pivot point. A big heavy log, so yeah. Super easy, I got really, really lucky there. Okay, so I just lifted it up and I put that little log under it, that little branch, and uh, it should pull it up there. I'll probably reposition that log just so it's pulling a little more up. Maybe I'll put it right at the base of this hill and that will roll that way. Okay, let's try this. I repositioned the uh, cable too, so it's it's on the bottom. Should help it a bit. Stop right on that branch. There we go. When I pull, it should lift the front end up. That's the plan, folks. We got her, folks. Works pretty good. Oh, and the log even stayed there, the branch. Okay. Well, it's not the easiest place I've ever pulled a tree out of, that's for sure. But we got her done. That's how she's done, folks. Still some snow on her there. So now the plan here is to back my truck up in there and then winch this thing right into the back of my truck. I'm gonna have to cut some off the end here. It's probably like 12 feet long this spot, this one. but So you'll see my uh, winch set up in a minute here. Okay, that should be close there and I'll back into here and then try and winch it on. That's the plan. Well, there we go. Backed right in there. So this is going to be really close. I should have did this yesterday, the other day. I don't know what I was... I kind of actually thought of it first and then uh, I'd already pulled them too far concentrating on making the video. Anyway, you can see it's, it's only like a foot up on that side and six inches on this side. So anyway, I got my little uh, winch set up, brought my trusty uh, little Radley there. It's been a year since I've had that saw now. 
Anyway, um, yeah, I just put my chain across there. That's just a little 1,500 pound winch that I've had forever. I think I paid like 50 bucks for it at Canadian Tire. So uh, we're gonna see what she's uh, made of there. I brought another one, that one. I have like about three or four of these, of those right there. Um, just every time I get a quad, I pull them off and I put a better winch on. But they work good for stuff like this. So yeah, we got a uh, little 12 volt battery. We'll hook it up to there. And then I brought my quad ramps, but I don't think I'm gonna need them. I'm just gonna drag them up to here and it should just skid right in. Yeah, and then we'll buck the end off or whatever we're gonna do there. Oh, oh no, 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 there goes my big boots. Let's try that there, folks. For all you folks just tuning in to this episode. Just the free school. Will it reach? Hope so. Gonna be close. Is that another wrap I got on there? I think so. Okay, let's try this. Oh, I do have another wrap. We got lots. Okay, let's see what happens here. Lock her in. She'll lock. There she goes. And then we got this. should uh, move here. This isn't the greatest setup, but hopefully it'll, it's going to work here. Should get out of the way. Oh, God, that's for sure. get it up this little ledge here so I'll have to put a branch or something I do have those ramps but I don't think I'm gonna need them or I'll just be able to put a branch there and uh, should skid it right up hey I don't know if that's gonna work but we're gonna give it a go here There she goes. We're back. The old GoPro Hero 1, where it all began. I dropped it and it said SOS on the screen. It's funny. Anyway, I just heard three gunshots, so I think somebody just got an animal. And um, anyway, I we're not going to make this lip. Like, I could mess around with it. But the thing's, you know, going to be sticking out the tailgate. I only need eight feet or so here anyways. So I'm just going to buck a little bit off the end and take the bigger section of log up there.
Bradley. Well, I heard three shots. I heard one boom. And then not long after, I heard two more, like just a couple of seconds later, I heard two more, like fairly fast. So I'm thinking somebody shot a moose. Lots of moose out here in this spot. We're good, right there. Still nice inside there, right on. Bark's just rotted. You get them before they've been down too, too long. This one's been there for probably a year and a half or so, I don't know. It'll be fine still. I just hate to waste cut down another tree when this one's down. Just made a really, really bad move that could have got me hurt pretty bad if not uh, killed.